This here is my bump fire machine, and everybody knows this is a completely stock and unmodified weapon. This is semi-automatic only, and I get a lot of questions as to how I can bump fire this weapon off the bipod. Well, take a look. This bipod has a little bit of forward and backward movement. Well, most bipods have a little bit of movement in them. And this isn't the normal bipod I use, but I figured this one right here would show it just as good. Now, because it has a little bit of forward and backward movement, really all I need to do is use the spring. And what I mean by spring is, normally the spring is your left hand. And when you're pulling forward, the only thing stopping the weapon is your trigger finger. And that allows you to bump fire. Well, off the bipod, that spring is moved from the front of the weapon to the back of the weapon. Now, rather than pulling forward, I'm just kind of pushing forward. Now, remember, everything is controlled with the left hand. Even in this form of bump fire, it's still controlled by the left hand. So, all your right, left, up, down, everything is controlled with the right hand. The only thing I'm doing with the, with, with the left hand, the only thing I'm doing with the right hand is only pulling the trigger. So, as I'm looking at the target, all I have to do is just just push forward with my, with my fingers, and when I'm pushing forward with my fingers, I'm doing it just hard enough to set off the trigger. Now, as long as you have a little bit of movement in the bipod, and you got a little bit of spring action with the fingers, it'll continue to fire. And that's how simple it is to fire off the bipod. Now, to fire off the shoulder is a little bit different. All you're doing is you're holding the rifle like so, and as you're doing that, you're pulling forward, as I've always shown, you're always pulling forward with the left hand. You're pulling forward, and the only thing stopping it is the trigger finger. Now, you're not placing this really against the shoulder. This is just touching the shoulder. You know, a little fatty section of the shoulder that has a little bit of a bounce to it. Um, it's just resting there just ever so gently. And I do mean ever so gently. Everything is controlled with the left arm. So that's only doing nothing but just a little bit of extra stabilization. Uh, if I was to pull the trigger, this rifle would recoil. Well, it's not going to recoil enough to prevent the bump fire. You know, you, all you need is just that quarter of an inch. And as long as you're pulling forward with the rifle and your trigger finger is stopping it from going forward, it'll bump fire. Nice and simple. There you go.